Hello friends and enemies, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a fashion haul for you. I went to Forever 21, well I, I didn't go there because I don't really leave my house. I went to their website and I ordered some clothes for winter, specifically to go on tour with my band Ascilla for the second time in Canada. Definitely come and see us if you are able to, that would be so cool. So I got a bunch of socks, uh, regular boring little ankle socks. And then in addition to the boring regular socks, I have these two pairs of over the knee socks, one in burgundy and one in gray. I normally buy these at Value Village. I normally buy them secondhand, but I thought that this one was kind of cool because it has this big round buckle. And I'm just looking at it now realizing I don't know how it does up. So let's try, oh, it's gonna, I'm gonna look like a pirate with this sweater, oh no. Oh wow, it's small. I think I bought the small size and now I'm kind of regretting it. Ooh, oh my. This is a nice belt. Oh, I love it. Look at that. I, I just need a good waist belt. Oh my goodness, I'm like, I'm just so excited to show you uh, two of these shirts in particular. They are really cool. And just looking at this one now, I almost didn't buy it and I'm just so happy I bought it. And Hold on, I'm getting ahead of myself. So I also got hats and earmuffs, and I got them in black and in pink because I don't know who I am. Some days I am this, some days I am this. So like this cover is pretty much my entire wardrobe. Dear Satan, please let this hat look good on me. Please don't let it look like I'm smuggling a pie underneath of it. Please. Don't make it make me look like a gnome. Thank you. I'm scared to look. Oh no, I don't know. I don't think it's good. I'm scared to look. Okay. Okay. Oh, hey, it's all right. I look like uh, the robber from The Sims, the original Sims. Didn't they wear like a beanie like this? Toque, haha, <laughs> what country am I in? <laughs> it's good, actually. I'm okay with it. Does this go like all the way down though? Can I make it like slow? Ooh, it looks kind of, no, see? I bet I could probably like slouch it a lot more. That's kind of something. Does it look like, no, Shh. let's not make anatomy jokes. Oh, these are like twisted opposite directions for some reason. I don't know if you can see it, but they don't really twist themselves, but they're like labor packaged flat, I guess. So now they're kind of just like twisted permanently. So I hope, yeah, see, look, they, they don't, maybe I have them the wrong way. Uh, you know what? They're really low down. Like if I put them so that the headrest is like, the headrest, the headband part is like actually on my head, then the, the tips of my ears are actually like sticking out the top. You can't really see because my hair. Do, do they go like this? Am I wearing them wrong? Well, this looks stupid. Oh, yeah. Okay, so the pink ones do fit better. Yeah. Should I start with the tops or the bottoms? I'm gonna start with the bottoms because I think the tops are more exciting. And uh, let's go with the one I'm not excited about because it doesn't look like how I thought it would look. So it's a red corduroy circle skirt. Oh, you see on camera it looks shiny. In person it is not shiny at all. It looks like carpet, like a carpet bag. Like when you go to Valley Village and you see those old like, almost like a, why is my brain telling me trundle? There's no such thing as a trundle bag, a duffel bag, you fucking idiot. That's what it looks like in person, but on camera it actually looks shiny. And that was why I bought it because on the website in the pictures it looked shiny. And I'm guessing now that's because it has these little ridges in it. So like the light is hitting the top of the ridge and then there's like the, yeah, you know what I mean. It's just an optical illusion. And I wanted this because I was like, oh, shiny, this is gonna be perfect to wear on stage. And I thought it would be warm, but it is not lined. It's just, it's, oh, I can see, I can see the light through it. Um, yeah, I, I think it's gonna look good on because it is a circle skirt, which is super, super flattering on almost every single person. Especially if you have a tiny little waist, it makes that, it just like really accentuates it. And it also makes you look like you have a bigger butt, which 
Hello, I need, I don't really have much of a ass. Meh. It gets a meh, that's the rating. Eh, eh. Next up, I think these next two are both skorts, which is a new favorite thing of mine. Uh, you may have seen me wear those, the little red skort that I got from Yesel. You may have seen me wear that to death. I have literally worn it to death. It is not wearable anymore. This, it actually broke when I went to the bathroom at um, a show and I was in the bathroom for like this really long time and I couldn't figure out how to like get the zipper up because it broke, it stuck down. And I ended up um, like moving my outfit around to like cover it and then awkwardly kind of walked around hoping my pants didn't fall down in front of everyone. So yeah, I don't wear it anymore. But uh, I bought two replacements. Here's the first, that's the back. So you can see they are shorts. And then there's the front and um, I do wish the front looked more like a skirt, but we'll have to see what it looks like on. In the website pictures, this made the model's legs look super, super long, which I love because I've got some like thin legs, but they are short legs. So I like anything that makes me look really tall and leggy. You may have noticed, that's why I wear those platform shoes all the time. This is plaid, which I thought was really cute and is apparently very in for fall, winter this year. And early next year, I guess. And this kind of has this little, is that a pocket? Oh, look, pockets. There's pockets, nice. Okay, so mm, I'm excited to try these on. They look really good. This one, I didn't think I would be so excited about, but then I'm, when I picked it up out of the box, it is so heavy and I'm kind of looking forward to seeing how this works because I love texture. So here, it's kind of this like, I want to say houndstooth, but it's most certainly not houndstooth. It's this, it's again this sort of like, I think it fits with the plaid very well. It's sort of like, oh my God, it reminds me of the nanny. So yeah, from the back, shorts. <laughs> it's like the mullet of pants business in the back. Wait, that's not right, is it? <laughs> you know what I mean. Here's the back, here's the front, and on the side it has this little thing, thing, yeah, sure, little thing. I don't know what you, what do you call this? It's not a buckle, but it's pretending to be a buckle. It wants to be a buckle. It's gonna make it a little tighter. Oh, I like the hidden zipper. I actually love these, but it is making me nervous because this is the kind of zipper I broke on the other skirt. Mm. Oh, and it has the little hook in the back, which is very nice. I like that. It, it helps you close stuff. Good job, Arianette. Oh, I'm excited. This one's a little bit longer than the other one, so that'll be nice if the other one's too short, won't it? Because I'm thinking that other one might show a bit more butt cheek than I intended on showing in the dead of winter. The last skirt is, uh, I definitely saved the prettiest one for last. I look disappointed because I know I'm going to ruin this. I bought these to go on tour with me to like wear on stage and everything. And like I'm looking at this and it's so delicate and pretty and white and like I'm gonna destroy it. But you know what, I'm pretty good at laundry so like Maybe we'll be okay. For the shirts, wait, I'm gonna reorder them so I don't show you the best one first. I wanna save it. First up is <laughs> this, <laughs> let me explain. There's a reason. There's a reason, okay? This was like $11. All of these things, by the way, were like on sale. There was like a 20% off coupon at the end of it as well. So like, yeah, I got a good deal. Okay, but there is a story. I like live streams. I'm obsessed with live streams. And one of my favorite live streamers, his name is Sam Pepper. And I thought, why not buy this Pepper shirt? <laughs> I'm a weirdo. Yeah, I'm, I understand, it's okay. I don't know when I'm gonna wear this. I just wanted to show my support <laughs> in a very unrelated way. Oh uh, yeah, the duck live stream for my last video, for my last vlog, the duck live stream I was watching, that was his. So yeah, um, mm, this is actually really interesting. The armholes are huge. I never wear shirts like this. Um, I never really go for this kind of sleeve because I've got very broad shoulders and it just looks a, a little bit masculine. 
but we'll see this one feels like it might actually be a bit too tight because I don't even have a bra on right now and it's like a little bit tight around that area so I hope it fits okay um, I thought I was a small but maybe I'm not a small this is this is a bit different it's very like old school vintage vibe sort of blouse that you might see a secretary in Mad Men wearing and it has all these little cute colorful teacups on it. The sleeves are quite long and they've got these little fabric covered buttons and these are the same buttons that are down the front too so like that's I, I really like that a lot because um, in pictures sometimes the shiny buttons like this they um, they glare on flash and yeah I just I I like these, I think they're really delicate. And then it has this uh, pussycat bow around the neck. I'm really losing my voice, <laughs> it's so bad. <clears throat> so I'm very excited to try this on. I hope it looks as cute as I, as I hope, as I pictured it looking. I think it might go really good with this skirt, but it also, I think, will go really good with this. So all of these things that I got, I got them in the hopes that they were kind of interchangeable. I tried to buy things in the same colors and similar sort of style. Okay, two more. This one is really, really pretty. Okay, my expectations are in the gutter for this because it is so pretty in the pictures on the website that it just can't be, it can't be that pretty in real life. There has to be something wrong with it. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's very flimsy. We'll see how it goes. Oh yeah, it won't be as... What the fuck is happening here? What? Okay, mmm. It has like one sleeve with elastic in it that's really tight that I guess goes around your arm like that. And then it has this other sleeve that's um... big and loose and in the picture I thought she just had one like off. But no it's designed that way so I know this is gonna annoy me when I wear it also the back the zipper is gold and that bugs me to no end because it just stands out so much I'm like why why silver would be better I don't know we'll see it on that's one of those things that you have to see it on with the right bra okay last shirt I'm really excited about this one because like most people my age I love Disney I'm obsessed I used to go to Disney parks all the time. I love Disney so much. So Forever 21 currently has this like big Disney collection they're doing and I looked at it and I thought like, you know what, I like all the pieces in it. Kind of inspired my color palette a lot actually because I wanted to get this shirt, specifically this shirt. This was the only one that I looked at that I was like, yeah, you know what, I will be mad at myself if I don't buy that. And everything else in the collection I might go back and have a look at it later when it goes on sale, but for now, I have my shirt. I kind of have a thing for this like uh, Catholic school uniform sort of vibe you may have noticed. That is because I did in fact go to Catholic school when I was in elementary school and I was in Australia and we had to wear uniforms. So I've always kind of loved this like dress shirt, uh, wool skirt, kind of over the knee socks, you know, you know the look. The chunky platform shoes, yeah, you know it. So this shirt, it's actually very thick. Is this 100% cotton? 100% cotton. Um, ooh, the back is nice. Now I'm worried because I don't own an iron. I have a steamer and I think I'm gonna have to buy an iron. There's some creases. There's like a, there's like a nice pleat. What is this? Pleat crease, I don't know, in the back. That's gonna look really nice. I like little details like that. And then on here we have these, they're probably patches, because they are like really, really stiff. And up here it almost feels like his head was a patch that was sewn on, and then his ears were embroidered on after, and it feels the same for Minnie, but I'm not sure. Either way, it looks nice. Up close it looks really good too. Oh, I'm excited. Ah. Well, I guess uh, I'm gonna try these on, and I'm gonna pair them up together and just put together like four looks, I guess. Um, why do I look like I'm going to Hogwarts? 
Okay, okay, there's a bunch of stuff going on. The, uh, the sleeves are a little tight around the wrist. It's very wrinkly. Um, it's baggy in the middle, which is okay. Okay, so I'm learning that I could go for an extra small if it's available. This is a bit um, baggy around the middle too, and typically, well, last time on tour I lost weight, so I'm a little bit worried about how they're gonna stay up. Um, they're, they seem to be shorter at the back than the front, which is interesting. If I pull them up all the way, oh yeah, there's butt cheek, I can feel it. <laughs> Just a cold breeze. Uh, I think they look really nice. It's very soft, actually, and even this is like very soft, but 100% cotton. Uh, these are itchy, and they're also tight. I normally don't have this problem with the, the bunching here. Um, I noticed that when they were in the package, they were rolled down like this. But I don't know which is better. Actually, I do kind of like them rolled down. Let's complete the outfit. What do you think? <laughs> I do actually really like it. Yeah, it's good. This is baggy. This is really, really big. I'm going to have to figure that out. Um, oh, whoops, on top of my other shirt. Just in case you want to see it untucked. I'm gonna try that for my lacrosse team. Oh, I love these, these bottoms, the skirt, skirt, shorts, pants. What do I call these, pants? Can we agree on pants? Okay, um, first off, this one feels a lot nicer. See, it's a much better, oh goodness, it's a much better um, fit. It's definitely not as baggy. Also, it's it's more like feminine. It, it floats, you can kind of see. It's definitely like a blouse. And let's just get the neck. Is this like to prevent people peering down your shirt? Like, does it hold it together? Is that what it is? <gasps> Oh my goodness, I love this. I really like this. I think this is so cute. Am I, are you with me? Am I like, am I, is this what it's like when you turn 30? Like, I don't, I'm not 30 yet next year. I'm only 29 right now. Oh, this actually works. This does tighten it. Oh, it's so nice. I feel like from the back, I look like a page boy. I look like, Squire, but <laughs> from the front it's like, oh no, that's a girl. But then from the back it's like, mm, I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know. Like, like if I put my hair away, does it get more confusing? My name is Billy. What do you think? I love this. I think it's really cute. And I wanted to get squirts because uh, I want to wear these on stage and if we're on like a raised platform I don't want people to be able to like necessarily see up my skirt so a skirt is like perfect otherwise I'll have to wear bloomers or something ridiculous. What year am I from honestly? Okay so first of all I have the wrong bra on and I have a camisole underneath that's the navy I don't know if you can actually see it probably can oh well that's short <laughs> it's a it is see-through I can definitely see the navy of my camisole right here so just be aware this is see-through you need nude panties or like um like a nice nude camisole that covers everything just uh probably wear a thong I know that this top is going to be really uncomfortable for me to wear, but I want to figure it out, but I know this is going to be annoying, especially when I'm playing piano, moving my arms around a lot, but I do think it's very pretty, especially with this skirt. I didn't realize they would look so nice together. Also, look how fun this is. Okay, yeah, that's way cuter than I thought. Oh, look how cute that is. <laughs> Guys, I don't think I'll wear this one on stage because I, I got it because of the live streamer, but yeah, what do you think? <laughs> I think it's really cute. Oh, that's definitely gonna show my butt. I gotta be careful. 
problem. <laughs> Um, yeah, these skirts are fantastic for most body types. So if you've never tried one, go and try one. It's called a circle skirt, and it's called that because it is. It looks like a big circle when you lay it out in the fabric or something. I don't know. <laughs> They're just so cute. They make your butt look bigger than it is, and uh, they make your hips kind of like pop out in your waist cinching. If I tucked this in, it'll make my waist look even smaller. And then, if you really, really, really want to see the full effect, may as well. You can add in a belt, like a waist belt. Tiny, right? It just cinches everything together. But that's enough for me today. Uh, my name is Arianette. Thank you so much for clicking on me today. There were so many things on YouTube that you could have clicked on, but you chose me, and that makes me super happy. I will see you really soon.